In this video, you'll see how to deploy AWS Config Conformance Packs using a delegated admin account. With this feature, you can register a delegated admin account, deploy config resources from that account, and then manage those resources for your organization. Instead of using your organization's master account to perform all facets of administration across all AWS resources, you can securely delegate admin privileges within a specified domain. To see how, let's register a delegated admin account and use it to deploy an AWS Config conformance pack. Navigate to Config to get started. Go to the Settings page. In order to deploy a conformance pack to your organization, you must have AWS Config set up in the region to which the conformance pack will be deployed and recording must be turned on for all accounts that will receive the pack. You must also have an Amazon Simple Storage Service, or Amazon S3, delivery bucket set up for the conformance pack, with permissions allowing each account in the organization to read and write from its service-length AWS config role. For the purposes of this example, these prerequisites have been met. Next, we'll use the AWS Command Line Interface, or CLI, to deploy the conformance pack. First, let's view the accounts in the organization by using the List Accounts command. Notice that the command is being run with the profile flag set to Master. Here you can see three accounts, Master, Delegated Admin, and Member. Next, let's make sure the organization-wide AWS Config service is enabled so we can deploy the conformance pack. At any point, you can easily see which accounts have been granted Delegated Administrator status by using the List Delegated Administrators command. At the moment, no accounts have been granted that status. Next, let's register the Delegated Admin account. Let's list the Delegated Admins again. As you can see, the Delegated Admin account was successfully registered. Now let's switch to the Delegated Admin account, signed in as an Administrator. Because this account has been granted administrative privileges for AWS Config, it can be used to deploy a Config conformance pack to the organization through the AWS CLI. With the Put Organization Conformance Pack command, you can specify a YAML template that outlines compliance criteria and the resources that must fulfill them. Let's deploy the Operational Best Practices for CIS conformance pack. Note that we are running this command with the profile flag Delegated Admin. Any assigned user with the access key and secret access key for the delegated admin account can execute actions with the permissions granted by the master account. The conformance pack has been successfully deployed. Next, let's run the Describe Organization Conformance Packs command to ensure that this conformance pack is now listed in the organization. The conformance pack we just deployed is listed. Next, let's switch to a member account, which has no administrative privileges in AWS Config. Since the deployment was successful and config properly enabled, all member accounts in the AWS organization should now have the conformance pack applied. As you can see, the conformance pack successfully deployed to the member account's AWS config service. Let's drill down and take a closer look. All the rules associated with the pack, as well as their compliance status, are shown properly. Let's take a look at the Settings tab. Here you can see the conformance pack name and the S3 delivery bucket location. Note that any delivery bucket for an AWS organization conformance pack deployment must have a name prefixed with AWS Config Conforms. Let's drill down into one of the rules. A notice informs us that the rule was created as a service-linked AWS Config rule, independent of the member account. This shows that the rule was generated at the organization level. Now let's return to the master account and open the CLI. If you no longer want to manage conformance packs at the organization level using a delegated admin account, you can tear down the conformance packs and deregister the delegated admin account from the organization. Let's delete the conformance pack we added by running the Delete Organization Conformance Pack command. Note that we are using the delegated admin profile. We'll now deregister the delegated administrator account using the master account. You've just seen how to deploy AWS Config conformance packs using a delegated admin account. Thanks for watching. Now it's your turn to try.